Told you, grab all that, didn't I, Jam? No problem. Get a sweeping brush out, Jam. You know, I bet this guy's really good when he goes to the seaside. <laughs> Be able to win you a teddy bear every time. <laughs> good afternoon. In fact, good evening, ladies and gents. Um, we're well into the next week and I thought I'd do a quick update with the light failing while I've got the opportunity uh, before I take all this shuttering up. So yesterday we poured the concrete for the footings and we've got a C30 mix in here. We ordered a C20 and apparently the guy was going to another job with uh, this stuff on and they didn't want him. So we got it instead. So this stuff, I think he said was around a 50 quid a cube more than what we paid for so we've got some good footings concrete down here everything has been uh, shuttered off as per the request for from the building control you can see down here we've got the gas pipe which goes into a sleeve through the concrete and then the same can be said about the electricity and the water around there and uh, I'm really pleased with it 110 barras minimum we kind of lost count after a hundred uh, it took me about an hour to get it all in and then I've not floated it off perfectly so over here for instance it does go down by about half an inch but we can take that up with the first and second course been and got a quote for the bricks so I'm not really happy with the price but it's not too bad considering the ones that we wanted were £1.81 a brick the ones that we're looking at we've got down to about 93 pence including VAT so the next job is for us to remove all the shuttering most of it's coming out quite easily this stuff along here because of the height of that wall behind it that uh, mound I'm actually going to leave in until we get some block work in but the stuff on this side is going to have to come out because we need to excavate all of this floor level next so we can put drainage in and start the wall building but it's all going to plan I'm just running out of time I'm extremely busy doing this kind of stuff and flit, flitting between here and work is becoming a bit difficult and I need to find time to brew some beer but I also have to get my order for the bricks in so I'm kind of informed that the prices are going to go up in the new year. So that's something that we don't want to have to stomach. So that's, uh, that's today's update. What are we on? Tuesday the 6th of December. We've got footings in on the 5th. It's all gone nice and solid.
Right, I can walk on it. I just fell down this bit here, which is why it's all caved in. But what we'll do, we'll just get this like slanted off either side, sweep off the footing, and then we'll be ready to start laying our concrete. Uh, block work, sorry, laying our concrete, you plonker. So there we are. Not much else to really talk about until we see some movement. It's just very slow going and lots of work on the computer, figuring out how many bricks and blocks I need and that kind of thing. Um, I think as well, this wall here, which is going to have to be a retaining wall, I'm going to build it internally and externally with concrete block. And then I think I'm going to paint on the bitumous uh, water repellent stuff and it's uh, because it's all going to be below ground um, We're going to do it in block work and then when we get to the top We'll do three course of engineering to tidy it up double block on the outside up to the top 150 mil come back in three courses of engineering and then we'll come out the ground proper Then we can backfill all this once it's got uh, a double retaining wall in and then inside as well we'll be uh, filling the cavity to a certain height so that the internal and external leaf aren't under any pressure and sloping that backfill to the front edge and then uh, insulation boards and the cavity tray will be raised up about 600 700 mil above normal so it will kind of be the cavity tray will be about here rather than down there, which shouldn't really be a problem. But we'll see, I'll keep in touch with the building control and uh, we'll do whatever they want us to do. So there we are, that's another uh, instalment of the self-build I guess, and we'll see you on the next one. Cheers.